Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Okay, bar pizza. You know, the concept is nothing new, but when the peeps over at Good Old B-Dubs do it their way, guys, you already know. So stay tuned because up next, I've got the all new Honey Barbecue Boneless Bar Pizza on tap. Welcome to Peep This Out Reviews with Ian K. Stay frosty. Wow, there is no shortage of honey barbecue sauce on this one, guys. Feast your eyes on this one a little bit more closely. Here we go with the honey barbecue boneless bar pizza at B-Dubs. And as you can see, a very saucy situation for sure with a whole bunch of toppings. Let's break this one on down real fast. Yep, yep, the presentation is definitely on point with this one. All right, what we've got here is a thin crust pizza topped with a laundry list of ingredients, starting off with boneless wings, honey barbecue sauce, mozzarella cheese, a cheddar and jack cheese blend, medium buffalo sauce, bacon, pickled hot peppers, and green onions. So guys, this looks like the epitome of a fun bar pizza for sure. Something you'd wanna have on your table while you're watching the game. This is looking really, really nice. And again, that presentation is killer, along with the aroma, I have to say, it smells pretty awesome. So there you go, it's the all new Honey Barbecue Boneless Bar Pizza here at Buffalo Wild Wings. Let's peep out this flavor. I gotta say, I'm really digging how all these toppings are stacked on this one, guys. I mean, the boneless chicken pieces along with the pickled hot peppers look pretty awesome on this one. And considering this actually has medium buffalo sauce on top of it, I'm expecting a little bit of heat. Just to be on the safe side, I got my trusty water bottle ready to go. All right, let me pick up one of these pieces here. And wow, this is very nice. Cut very beautifully. And as you can see, glistening in the sun there, plenty of saucy action with this one, guys. Looking nice and again, Stack toppings, that boneless chicken looks pretty awesome on this. A Little bit of the dusting that I'm feeling from the bottom of this one, very, very nice. So here we go, it's the Honey Barbecue Boneless Bar Pizza here at Buffalo Wild Wings. Let's peep this out. Mmm, sweet, mmm. We're right off the break, outside of the sweetness, I'm kind of getting a focaccia vibe with this one, guys. Almost like a flatbread type of situation. I wouldn't say pizza necessarily, but again, it's not really a traditional pizza in that sense. But the crunchiness of the boneless chicken is not bad on this, and a little bit of the heat coming through with that buffalo sauce. I'm not really getting too much just yet, but totally digging the flavor, and of course, the honey barbecue is really standing out on this. Let's keep going in. Hmm. Hot pickled peppers, there it is. Ooh. A little steamy. Mm. That's pretty tasty. But again, a focaccia-like situation with this. And don't get me wrong, I like it, it's tasty. But again, not really a traditional pizza in that sense. I'm not really getting too much cheese just yet. So you know what, because this is an end piece, it doesn't really have too much apparently. Let me pick up one of the middle pieces here and give this a shot. Looks like we've got more cheesy action here. This should be pretty good. But as you can see, no shortage of the sauce, guys. It's very flavorful, and I gotta say, I am totally digging this so far. Let's keep going in. Mmm, there it is. Got a little bit of bacon in that bite, guys, and it actually adds very nicely, a nice bit of smokiness on top of the honey barbecue. But again, not really pizza-like from what I was expecting here, but it's fun, I have to admit for a flatbread focaccia-like situation with some boneless chicken on here just because it's B-dubs. The peppers are definitely a nice situation as well, and the sweetness of that honey mustard is definitely up there. And as I'm going further in here, it's getting a little steamy, hang on. Mm. So much better, I'm so glad that I brought something on top of it being crazy hot here in Southern Cali right now. But not bad on this one, guys, again, now, for what the toppings are in this, you're getting some classic B-Dev goodness with their sauce and, of course, with the boneless chicken. So, let's just go for a couple more on this one. I think I've gotten pretty much everything out of this. I'm digging it. It's not bad. But pizza, mm, that's a little bit of a stretch. Let's keep going in for a couple more. Pizza, flatbread, focaccia, whatever you want to call this, it's still very flavorful, guys. And again, with that medium buffalo sauce coming through beautifully with the chicken, that's a nice add-on accent along with those peppers. So pretty nice on this one, but I got to admit, the cheese is getting lighter and lighter as I'm going in. Doesn't really appear that I have too much on this. And you know what? That's a little bit of a shame because I wish I had just a little bit more cheese to go with. And even though barbecue sauce technically on pizza is not really my go-to, it's okay for what it is. The flavor of the honey barbecue is pretty bomb on this. So let's go for one more bite. We'll wrap the review up with the rating coming up next. But again, whatever you want to call this one, pizza, flatbread, or focaccia, it's still pretty tasty. One more bite and we'll close it out. Hang on. You know, nice presentation aside, this one definitely has some pretty nice flavor and a decent amount of heat thanks to the medium buffalo sauce, guys. And when you combine that with the sweetness of the honey barbecue sauce, it's a pretty nice situation. More of an appetizer type of thing, not necessarily a meal, but for what it is, it'll definitely light up your taste buds with some pretty decent flavor. Not bad on this one, even if calling it pizza is just a little bit of a stretch in my opinion. Buffalo Wild Wings. 
So with that said, I'm gonna have to give the all new Honey Barbecue Boneless Bar Pizza here at Buffalo Wild Wings a pretty okay seven out of 10. Like I said, guys, calling this a pizza is a little bit of a stretch, but what you're getting quality wise in terms of the flavor is gonna be pretty tasty. It's got a decent amount of heat thanks to the medium buffalo sauce and the combination of that honey barbecue sauce to go with is a nice combination. I just wish I had a little bit more cheese on it naturally and overall just overall a feeling more of like a pizza. Like I said, more of a focaccia like situation with that. Very thin on the crust and I did like that actually because it's nice and crunchy, nice and crisp. But again, maybe if there was just a little bit more cheese on it, I think I would have been more inclined to maybe call this one a pizza or at least give me more of that vibe. But even still, very flavorful for what it is and for $9.99, not too bad for the price point. All right, so do me a favor, like always, drop some comments down below. Let me know what you thought of this particular one. I mean, have you given this one a shot over here at B-Dubs already? Did it satisfy your expectations in terms of flavor and maybe the value for $9.99? Drop those comments down below and definitely let me know. And with that, this is Ian K closing out another high quality foodie feature for you here on Peep The Sour Reviews, bringing you brand new content every single week here on my channel. So why stay tuned for the next review coming real soon. In the meantime, stay frosty. Yes, sir. Nice and flavorful on this one for sure, guys. But actually, after giving this one a shot right now, now I'm craving a real pizza. All right, everyone. Until next time, I'll talk to you soon. Hey, thanks for checking out another one of my reviews. But just in case you didn't see the one before this one, you can find it right up over here, along with what I think YouTube's going to recommend for you to check out as well. As always, I think you'll find something to like in both of them, and I'll definitely catch you in the next one. See ya.